Hello everyone. Today in this video I will tell you the details of sucking and rooting reflexes. I have already uploaded the details of Moro, Palmer grass, planter grass and stepping reflex on this YouTube channel. Today I am going to tell you the details of sucking and rooting reflex. These two reflex are very important for the survival of newborn after birth. Without these reflex, breastfeeding cannot be established. This reflex appears at 32 weeks of gestation age and disappears at around 3 months of age. Rarely it persists beyond 12 months of age. It doesn't mean that sucking will be absent after 3 months of age. This automatic or involuntary sucking reflex will be replaced by the motor activity or we can say baby sucking will be a result of conscious effort. It will no longer a involuntary reflex after 3 months of age. Now how to elicit the sucking reflex? In this picture you can see that examiner is inserting the finger into the baby's mouth and when it touches the palate of the baby's mouth in response to this sucking reflex is stimulated so strong and rapid sucking movements of the mouth will start whenever mother's breast nipple or any pacifier or artificial nipple is inserted into the baby's mouth when it touches the palate it stimulates the sucking reflex in newborn now what is the significance of this reflex this reflex is very important for establishment of the breastfeeding so sucking and swallowing reflex fully mature at 34 to 36 week of gestation age so the newborn more than 34 weeks of gestation age is able to coordinate the sucking and swallowing reflexes simultaneously during breastfeeding and this is known as sucking swallowing bre breathing sequence so between birth to the three months of age this reflex should be present normally and after that it should be replaced by the normal sucking activity not as a involuntary neonatal sucking reflex if it is absent during this period that means the newborn is having some neurological disorder or we can say some cns insult example seen after the severe birth asphyxia or if the newborn is suffering from some cns infection example pyomeningitis or having some inborn error of metabolism or newborn is unconscious due to any reason this reflex will be absent now another important reflex is rooting reflex it appears at 28 to 30 weeks of gestation age and it disappears at around four months of age it rarely persists beyond 12 months of age and it rarely present between 4 to 12 months of age it is also known as search reflex because due to this reflex newborn or infant is able to search the breast nipple for feeding to elicit this reflex examiner finger touches the newborn chick near the corner of mouth in this picture you can see the examiner is touching the finger near to the angle of mouth and in response to this newborn's head turns toward the examiner's finger and open her mouth for the feeding so this reflex is very important for the breastfeeding now what is the significance of this reflex between birth to four months of age it is present normally if it is absent between this period that means newborn is suffering from some neurological disorders as i said in the previous slide about the sucking reflex and after 12 months of age it rarely persists 
between 4 to 12 month it is really persist and after 12 month it should not be persist if it is persist that means the infant is having some hypersensitivity around the lips and mouth due to this social speech and learning problems will be there and difficulty with the solid foods will be there so the child will become the messy eater and also the dribbling of saliva will be there so ultimately there will be the problems of social and learnings thank you